Alrighty, welcome back. I'm your man, Bad Chad, and Queen Jolene's on the camera. Nate is in the house, and Doug is in the house, and we are on air. What I have done since the last video, I've taken the, the buckets that we had or that we cut off, I've cleaned them all up inside note to make them a good piece of metal to put onto the car. We basically don't want to put a rusty piece of metal on the car that we have. As I set, as I set this on here, and I was looking at it, you know, trying it on with like this, Nate walks up to me and he says, I hope there's no body filler there in that fender. And me too. <laughs> me too. I hope there's no body fill there in that fender. I have taken off the piece that I welded on the inside of the driver's side. I took that piece off. The, they're right there though. But what's going to happen is, is I've, I've found, what I've done is I've made both of them the same length. Basically, made them both the same length. And this way here, if I make them both the same length, and mark back on the on the from the headlight back the same on each fender they're going to fit in the exact same place is what i'm thinking so what i've done is i've taken a ruler or what i'm doing is taking a ruler going to run it along the straight line of the fender i can run it up a little further if i want to let's put some glasses on i'm going to run this ruler on this fender run on the line and then I'm going to make the line. That is the fender where the center of the line for the fender. Uh, we have a center line on these, so that's what I'm going to do to match it up. It makes sense to me. I have it, so why not use it? I do the exact same thing on this side. Line the center. Uh, I measured on this one. This one would tell me exactly what it wants to be. Remember when I measured this one back? Um, four inches. So now when we go to the other side, we will make a four inch mark. Four inch. So we have a mark of four inches on this side. So if I take the headlight door piece of metal that I'm using and I plant the line of this with that line, I should be able to tack that on there to hold it. And that way there, if I tack it on to hold it, then I can play with this down here, whether I want it up or down or whatever, and I can adjust the length of this, basically. I think that'd be an easier situation. But I have the line. Got a little denny poo right there I gotta fix. Gotta fix the dent. Not letting it set down right, so let's fix it. Just gonna lay here on the floor. Good. All right, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna clean off the part of the fender, what I think I'm gonna weld to, and I'm gonna have to make that line again. The straight line's already there, but let's, let's do it. Let's do a mark where somewhat is going to be where I need it to have. Lining that line up straight with that line. I went past the line there a little bit. You see my line? Yeah. This is my line. I want on that line. And there's the start of it. So I'm just going to take this in and mark that down there like that. That way there I can get somewhere as close where I'm going to start stripping it to apply it. Thanks for coming back everybody. We appreciate it. Yes we do. That's it. All metal. Keep your fingers crossed for the other side. I'm going to leave the rest of that paint on around there once I put that on there because that's just protecting that. This is where I'm going to weld it. Now 
One thing I forgot to do, or I got, I got to do, I'll do this right there. I have to make, like I said, when I weld these on here, I'm leaving that fender piece. I'm not cutting that off. But there's no need. But when I weld that on there, that's going to be underneath there. I do not want water and garbage shooting up in here from the wheel. So we'll do what they did. They had a headlight. I'm just going to make a cover for the headlight. A cover. I'm going to have to use my let's do this can't, can't see much anymore I can't Get a good line down here. Let's do this. A pair of scissors. We'll cut the line that we see. I'm just going to make a pattern. I don't have to make the piece of metal right now. It's just a round piece of metal that I'm going to actually uh, put on from the back side. Put that on there. Then we can get our shape. see it just easier to make the pattern now and then to try to tear off or have that light bucket welded over top probably could break it down a little bit what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it in Doug you want to do me a favor old buddy Okay, let's go, let's, let's, can you hold that on, on the inside of this? It's going to be hard to do, sort of. No. Um, so square it up and tell me where it sits yeah, right. Can you, that's not bad. Can you just hold it right there? Yep. That way there, I can put a couple clips on here. A couple clips on there. Screw this in from the back side, and then it'll close it off with light. You can pull it out now, Doug, if you like. Watch your arm, little buddy. And that's what I needed. Thank you. Head light L I G H T. Jesus, I wonder I spelled that right. Did I spell that right? Woohoo! Spelled it right, boys. Spelled it right. So I've got my pattern there for, for this one and this one. Uh, basically, all I have to do after I weld these on is I have to reach in and put a little clip in there, a little clip in there, and I'll screw that in, make two of those, and screw them in from the backside. I'll have it all sealed off. Now I'm going for this. Um, like, like, just like the taillights, um, I'm going on the fly on this, and there's no set rules for any of it, so basically I'm, I'm making up my own rules as I go along, and basically you can too as you're doing your ride. You, you do whatever you please, whatever you think needs to be done. There's more, more ways to put these headlight doors on than I'm going to do it, that's for sure. I'm just going to use that for now. See what happens. Turn this on. <coughs> We've got an air hose. Thanks, Jolene, for cleaning up the air hose. You must have put everything away too, didn't you? She's a my, she's my lady. Nope. I'm gonna grab the air. Her chan. Her chan. Alrighty. One tack will hold it on there. And two tacks, we'll have it in place, so we'll just... We'll do it this way.
Oh, got to measure it four inches first. We're going to throw that marker at. Let's do this again. I'm going to ground it off. That's why a tape is a lot better. I'm going to hold down that, sweetheart. Just hold it there like that. We're, we're at nine, so we got to go four. Draw this line straight again. Measured again. Okay, let's stick this bad boy on here. We'll deal with the levelness after. We'll just stick them on first, see if we even like them. Piece of metal's going there. I'm gonna line my line up. This is my line here. I cut past the line a little bit. I like it that much. Let's lay this on it and see. All I'm doing is using the line on each. What if she makes really good cheeseburgers? What if she makes really good cheeseburgers? <laughs> it might be a call to move on, huh? Well, we know the same level. You like greasy cheeseburgers too, Doug? I like greasy cheeseburgers. I'm just going to splash this ball over here. Gonna do the four inch here first. Now you got two. I, I picked the one out of the garbage. Even. I did. Get a straight line going again. Put a line on there. This one here, we're a little bit past our line, which is okay. Alrighty. Now I want to this ruler here. And I lay this ruler on here, up this line, lay it down that line. You can see that the headlight will lay it on this side. Come you can see that by rulers on the line. You can tell that the headlight is not. So when I put that on the line, I'm just going to have to move this headlight over until it's on the line. And to me, that's the line. Mark this down here. This one, see it? So I lay the lure on the line up here. And down on the headlight, right on that line there. See that line? I would say that's good. Let's 
seems to be okay. Yeah, we've got a couple other things I want to check. Um, yeah, I want to put the level up and down here. I'm not sure if I'm going to fit these in here or not. They definitely aren't five anymore. Let's do this. Um, Doug, you want to be my little helper for a minute, old buddy? I hate to take you away from that sand and inside the door. I know how much you like it. Oh, I love it. <laughs> I'll be your little Oompa Loompa helper here, though. Oompa Loompa. <laughs> All right, this here. See this? See what I got going on with the ruler here? See, I set that on that line. I put a line right on the middle. You're going by is a straight and narrow and your whole head bite? Well, I'm trying to make a straight line. You hold that straight there and see how we're. That's pretty well straight, is it not? It sure is. Right on our line. Okay. What I, when, you can take that away now. If we need to do it again, you know what to do. We'll just leave right there. I'm going to take. That's not even level close whatsoever. This job will keep an eye on you. Make sure you're doing a good job. She's always got her eye on you. Make sure you're doing a good job. I'm just kind of wondering. We often do. If. Um, are you able to hold that? Come over this side, Doug. Hold that on there. Hold that on there. Let's get it so it's level. See, that? We're just put this ball right here in the middle, if we can. Are you gonna, are you gonna? I can't hold second. that there like that. I'm gonna make it so you can hold it. Just a second now, don't put no more. I only got one little tack on that. A pair of vice grips. I'll get a pair of small vice grips. Can you hold it now, Doug, or? Yeah. Here, old buddy, let me snap that on there. Ouch! Yeah, right. You know I was gonna do you're that. You're gonna hold right? that level for me? You're, you're the man on the level, okay? Got you, bud. Okay, I'm the man on the line. Don't be leaning on my headlight. Okay, so it's gonna go over this way. Do we have it? Leave us alone, we're doing something. Go your way. Now, are you, I'm gonna turn that on. I gotta grab that thing. Probably underneath your foot it is. It is Don't too. say that. Come on now. It's underneath both of them. Oh. You have to let go, Doug, for just. Ah, I got something. Let's do it again. <sighs> Two, I'll have it in place and, and, uh, and then we can maybe move on, maybe. Easy stuff isn't worth doing anyways. What's but... that, buddy? Easy stuff ain't worth doing. Now, are you... Are you level? Am I level? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going by what Joe Are you? Yes. Am I level, Joe? A little more. Yeah, right there. Still on? I'm just going to tag it in, okay? Yep. Two on the line. Awesome. Okay. On the line, on the line, good. Ouch. Let's go to the other side. So it just needs to. I want to have this. We can make that level just by doing pushing that out. Just yes. Yeah. I just want to make sure we get we get a little bit of a. 
Okay, let's go to the other side. The headlight thing that we're putting on is a lot smaller than what we had. It's a lot smaller. And I'm okay with that. Does it seem like it's turned? It seems like it's turned, don't it? It does seem like it's turned this way a bit. Your body lines. It's got flow to it. Yeah, it's turned. It's supposed to because it runs with the body line, right? No. No. <laughs> no. Nope. Let's, uh, let's put this one on because this one looks straight. And we'll go back to that one. And the reason I say it looks straight is because this in the bottom here looks good. All right? See this bottom here? Straighten that up. Um, you want your pair of vice grips? Do you want that vice grip on there? I'm going to ask you one more favor, Doug. the hand for a sec. Yeah, I like how you... Nathan, you give his hand here just for a second. I think it would help us out. It would help us out a little bit. It would. Because I'm going to have to knock that one off. That one's crooked. I don't like it. You uh, would hold that ruler and keep that. I want it on. Let's keep the, see the edge of that line there? That line going on there. I want you to run right to that fence, right to this. See that little line down there? The black one. Yep, yep. Right there. Yep. Okay. Are we still straight or we got to move back? That's what I'm wondering. Are we still straight? On this line here. Okay. All the way. Okay, and it's up there. Nice. Yep. I just don't want yeah. to push down on that. Yeah, you can push down on that. Doug's going to push it where it needs to be level. You can push down on it to get it straight wherever you need to be it. I want this turned a little bit. Like that. Push that on the finger down here. It's fine. Can you can we hold it just like that? Try. Got a hold of it, Doug? Yeah. You good? Yeah. Should be able to let go of it. Okay, I'll put back on the line here. That's still lining up. Let go of it, Doug? All right, I like this. That can be held up just a little bit, just turned a little bit like that. I'm all right with that. Because I want this flat piece here going along flat with the... Mm -hmm. Let's go back to this, this, and knock this side off. But then again, I could turn that. And that might be all it needs. Let's come, come run this one, come, we do this. Just run it straight on that one, will you, please? You can leave that off for a sec. Yeah. Just leave it off just for a second. Is that what needs to be done? Is that straight? Right there, yep. So it just needs to be turned. Okay. Get it level again, Doug, if you will. Yeah. Oops, sorry. Tell me when you're when you're cooking gas, Doug. Are you level? Tell me when you're level. I'm level up here. Up top right here? Yeah. You're plum balled, are you? Plum balled. Yeah, I'm plum balled down the bottom too, so. Top and bottom. Everything. It's got a little lip on it. No, I'm gonna cut this off and we're gonna stick this in there and make that level. If you guys just bear with me for just for a second. As soon as I get them on, then I can start making pamphlets. That works, that holds us. Things twisted on me. I know what to do. Tack that down. So you wanna hold that in there? Is that if you hold that in there? I don't do, I wanna turn that down. Just a second, I wanna turn that. 
<laughs> it's just tying it around my feet, are we now? No. Still in line? Everything good? Yep, I did on the line here. Ouch. Son of a... Alright, let it go. Still got turn on us, isn't it? A little bit. Yeah. That's fine. Is that make when you put your thing on there, Doug, does that make it level? Seems to be. I'm gonna I'm just gonna take this. I'm gonna set that there. Will you set your level back on that and just push against it? See if it's a little bit off. Yeah. Which way? Out or in? Uh in. So the bottom's gonna go in? In at the top, out at the bottom. Not by very much though. But you were good. Yeah, right there. More tear in this car than I want to see the bottom of it. Oh yeah, it looks good. Okay. We need 15 people to hold it. Once we get a health, um, I'm a little bit off on the top. Too far out. It needs to, yeah, it's yeah, huh? It's a little well, bit too far in. It needs to come out a bit. The bottom or the top? Okay, let's let the bottom in then. Like just like I thought. Just let off for a second. How does that fit? better. Where is it? Is it good? Better up top. That's good right yep, there. Yep, that's good right there. All right, that'll hold it. Let's see what we got. It's nice down the bottom now. I like that. That's crooked as a ram's horn, that is. I might be able to cut that off there and straighten that out. Let's take it over a little bit. I don't like that, it's crooked. I know you're not even gonna see it. Oh, ah. Everything's hot. Ouch. I want to go take a look now. Ouch. Want a glove? Put up on the side, you want me to? That's pretty. Is it still level, Doug, right there? Yeah. Still level, buddy? Yes. A little off on the bottom, but... Yep, bubbles. Um, you went off. off? This one bottom on here. Listen. Okay. Yeah. What was that? Do that again, bud? I guess it matters where you put it, don't it? Yeah, it does. Big time. Because there, it's level. Here, it's not. Just had to bring it out some, that's all. Yeah. That level there? That's good right there. That's pretty much in the middle of it. Okay. That's good. I have to bang that bang. I got that little bend right there, probably no doubt in my mind. Just want to see if it's. That doesn't look straight on that line. <clears throat> Is it straight on that line there? That's good. Perf. Perf. Just said it's over, that's fine. All right, let's do it on the other side. Hmm. What's that? This, I'm just trying to make, just trying to get this straight here, this bottom. That's all what I'm trying to do is get that straight there. We got the straight on this one. Looks pretty straight. Which one on your side of the line? And I want to turn this up like this. That's what I want to do. Make this straight on the bottom. Um, I have another piece of square stock there. Yes. Okay. 
How much did I cut off the last one? Right there. First one I cut off. Dead on. Dead on. Right with you. Big bad Chad. Everybody pat the dog. A girlfriend. <laughs> One of your better looking ones, eh? Yep. Sure right about there? You're right about there. Go ahead, Chuck. <laughs> Help me the dog. What are you thinking? You liking that? It's not bad. Are you liking it or no? Yes or no? Huh? Oh, you like it? I got my eyes closed right now. I don't trust you. Just watch your eyes. You got no ground to see you. Yeah, your finger. <laughs> Am I good ground? No. Yeah, was that still? Yeah, it's level on the bottom, but it's a little bit off on the top. Let's see. All right. It needs to come out right there. Okay. Are you still holding it where it needs to be? Ready? No. And no. <laughs> no, here. It's a little bit off on both, right? Okay, you're pulling it in right, though? Yeah. Are you about there somewhere? I can hold it up there. You got her? Yeah. Zzz, zzz. Yeah. All right, you should hold it. I'm going to do a couple little things. Oh, thank you for the help. That's exactly what I needed. No. Oh. Six hands make light work. Six hands make light work. You said it, Doug. I'll keep my mat. Okay. There's another one over here. Take my mat. Oh, you can have that one. You can have, you can have that one, buddy. Ah, I don't need one. I'm going to roll around the dirt. <laughs> I know he does. I'm going to roll around the dirt. I'm going to roll around right. the dirt. Now, what I'm going to do, try to with steal them. Let's do this. In from the headlight, from that line right there, about five and an eighth. Five and three sixteenths. That's pretty damn good, you ask me. Five and an eighth. Good. Let's go from the bottom. Okay. A little more than five. Five and a quarter. Five and an eighth. No, nope, five and a quarter. Good. A little bend right there. That there piece, I'm thinking I'm gonna I'm gonna stick that in there a little bit better because that's doing the doing the holding. <laughs> Floor is not level, but. 34 right on the money. Floor's not level, but we'll, we'll check it. 34 and a half. Let's do this. And there definitely could be a half inch on this floor. 31 three quarters. Did I say that was? That's bent there, see, look. Yeah. 
Let's do this. Hmm, where'd that little level go? You got that little level, Douglas? Right down there in front of you, where the girl goes. I think we're pretty close. Nathan. I don't mind that for filler. That's what we'd have to have there. It's not bad. I mean, it's gonna have to be glassed. Okay. That's what you'd have. You had to fill that out. That's a good thing. You gotta have a place for filler. That's fine. Just stand back and take, keep taking a look at it. <laughs> Looks good to me. Actually. Come down. It's hard to tell. I want this one to come down a little bit. Can you see the difference? See any difference at all? Like, does this look like you can see more in there? That's basically what I'm going for. What's that? Yeah. Looks like you can see more underneath that one, doesn't it? I like how that one's straight there too, that piece of rod iron. That one on that one's crooked. Okay. Let's cut it off. Make it come down just a little bit. Just a little bit. Does that come down at all? What? Oh, and now we're talking. Let me turn that on. I'm gonna go for it, try it. This one. Looking better though. Right on the money. Straight going.
Ah, threw that tape measure down somewhere, didn't I? It's gotta come down. Watch your eyeballs. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. Liking it now. You like it? Baby? Just want that little bit of the opening underneath the headlight on each one. You see a little bit on each one, eh? I say we got her. Thank you. Yeah. Now. It's not bad. Tag it in place. I'm going to put my helmet on. I'm going to tack it up a little bit better. Don't nope, need those. I need to pull the helmet off. Do this. Just want to tack them. Just want to go back and take a look again because once I weld them on, once I weld them on, it's over. Got a little bit showing underneath that one, a little bit showing underneath that one. Got some outside showing in that one. Good. Awesome. Not going anywhere now. Tack this on a little better. Going back and forth, trying to dissipate the heat. Going back to the next. Uh, 
Sorry. this off for a second <laughs> let's come back and take a look that's the only way to do do it is just keep back keep taking a look see if everything's okay yeah, everything's okay same deal on the other side too perfect good same deal on the other side all righty now I'm thinking that if I have this line running straight going down through here, I'm thinking that our headlights straight with the fender. That's what I'm thinking. Um, that's what I'm thinking. And when we put the headlight in there, I'm thinking that we'll have a little bit of adjustment on either headlight. Yes, we will to make it right. So now it just comes a matter of starting making some pieces uh, to make it work. So I've got this pattern right there. Um, that's already made that pattern. I'll cut that out. I'll be able to put my clips here and before I put the headlight on here and then I can do all that stuff and screw it in from the back, no problem whatsoever. Yeah, let's make some pieces. But basically what I'm gonna do now, I guess, is try to make the same pieces on either side. And I'm gonna probably do it out of, um, not sure how many pieces right this second. I'm gonna pull this back out of the way. Take a look at it again. Got a little whip de doo going on there. That's fine though. Get some paper. Where are we at? Time. For a second. What you doing, Nate? Come, come take a look. Okay, Nathan has already got that rock and rolling already. He's cut these arms because they would not work on the inside of that on the window. I want to take a look myself just to see what he's doing. How do you know they had to be cut? Because it was binding up. It would bind up because it was out this way too far. And the glass is shoved in. Okay. Right. So basically, you cut that and move that in. Inboard, and I had to bend it and tweak it a little bit too. Right. And then, Does the window wind up? Yeah, I'm just making the stopper. Now it sets down, the stopper's going to set the glass right there. You can see how close that becomes to the door when we've changed the yeah. angle of the top of the door. Yeah, it's right yeah. close in behind now. Yeah. Close works. Look at that now, would you? Yeah. Beautiful. Not too bad. That makes me happy. That looks good. Moving on, he says. Alrighty, well, I guess what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this like this. And the reason being is I won't get, well, I don't have an hour to get a patch put on. But we have got the two headlights put on. And we're going to start fabricating. We're going to start fabricating uh, the pieces that enclose the headlights. Um, we might even run maybe I'm not sure we can no it's not far enough we could run something all the way straight across but our hoods out just a little bit further than that I'm liking how far the headlights are out it's out far as the front of the hood so what's gonna uh, yeah so we'll do this when we get back I apologize that we didn't get more done for a visual but that's the visual for the front end that we can do right now basically all right, everybody, thanks a lot for coming back. I really appreciate it. Um, I need a few hands to get them on there because it, it took, you know, obviously to see what's going on. I want the line straight, line straight. I want it plumb up and down. Um, I want them same height, that sort of stuff. So maybe I can use the same pattern. If I make the pattern on this side, the pattern I make on that side is going to work on that side just as long as I transfer it. All right, everybody, thanks a lot for coming back. We really appreciate it. Throw a like in, throw a comment in, throw a bad comment in. Um, Tell, tell Nate how much he's appreciated for that, and tell Doug how much he's appreciated, and Joanne's my queen. Have a great day, everybody. Come back tomorrow. We'll be here.